this is Beyond Two Souls number six. And there's a motherfucking fire. Oh my god. Let me guess, it's retaliation for beating their asses, isn't it? Or am I still in that building? Oh my god, Sam, people are still Sam, here. Wake up. Oh god. Where are the others? Walter's on this floor, Jimmy, and Tuesday and Zoe are upstairs. Get out of here, I'll go get them. No, 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 come with you. No, no, I'm going alone. Son of a whore. I said get out of here! <coughs> upstairs, huh? So... <coughs> son of a bitch. <coughs> If I can get I didn't. Tuesday, Tuesday and the baby. They're upstairs. We I'm aware. Save them before the whole place burns down. Yeah, I got you. Why is nobody else already out of this building anyway? I mean it's a burning to hell for a while. I got you, shit. See, David Cage, this kind of shit is where you shine. Oh my god. I'm aware. Help me! Someone help me! Come on, Jimmy! Jump! Jump! Jump, no. you dumb son no, of a bitch. I can't make it. You can't! I can't make it! You can't! Come on, jump! Jump, you motherfucker. If he doesn't move, we'll need to make him move. Alright. <laughs> what happened to you? Jump. You gotta get the baby. Next door. All right, next door, huh? <coughs> oh, motherfucker, oh, shit. There's gotta be another way. Okay, so I have to go out this window. Oh my Jesus. <sighs> with some crazy shit. Oh my god. Oh. Why would the button shoulder mashings? David Cage, you know I hate that. Johnny! Come on. That's definitely not good for a pregnant lady and a baby. Okay, come on. That doorknob should be burning, scalding hot. Hated my man. Poor Carnard. Oh God! Shit. My baby! Shit! My baby! Think, Jody. Think. <coughs> yeah, I did. Every single thing she gets into, like she items help for everything. Right downstairs, quick! 
that staircase is about to fucking fall on you. Yep. Or yeah, see. Keep going. Yeah. Okay, get out of here. You know you can just jump, right? Just jump for it. Or not. Okay, so how the fuck am I supposed to get out of here? Uh can I go upstairs? Again? And just jump out from the fire escape? That shouldn't work, right? There's a window. Oh my god. Alright, jump. Come on. Oh, Jesus, fuck. These button sequences are supposed to be. Oh! God fucking damn it, these button sequences. David Cage, I hate this shit. You know that. It's not my fault David Cage has the weirdest fucking QTEs known to mankind. What are you doing? Shit. Why are you doing this? Judy! Like honestly, who the fuck makes QTEs like that? The screen turns white for a little bit and you have to press the fucking joystick a certain way? Come on, Jody, you can make it. At least make it a goddamn button. Oh, come back, come back! Well, first off, you're doing CPR all wrong. I actually know how to do it, and that is not how you do it. First thing you gotta do is rip and open her shirt and take off her bra. That's not even bullshit. That's for real. Like you got, you, she has to have to be bare chested. All the game wouldn't do that. You have to have your uh, your arms need to be straight. There's so much shit you're doing wrong right now. Let the firefighter take care of it. She's not dead. Or at least I don't think she is. We need oxygen! Well, you're a firefighter, didn't you Lucy bring Lucy. oxygen? They saw they were shot. Don't leave us. Is she gonna wake up in a hospital now? I get this is a loading screen, but come on. Am I dead? No. You're in a hospital, probably. <clears throat> or you're in the movie The Ring. And Samoan, or wherever the hell her name is, is about to come out of the okay. TV. All right, I've got to get closer. I really have no idea what the fuck's going on now. <laughs> and apparently now she's having a baby. Wait, wait, wait. Let me see her. Just one. That's my baby. 
That's fantastic. Jesus I don't know what the fuck's going on. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Who was that woman? Why are you showing me this? She, was she that her mom or some shit? Probably. Are you really gonna make me approach the TV screen every time some shit happens? <laughs> I guess, so there's going to be some kind of apocalypse happening. up in the hospital. Why did they shave her head? Too fucking bad. I didn't, didn't will it. Oh, you're just gonna take that thing out? Huh. Nah, let's go here first. Part of the bathroom, right? Correct. You know what sucks is that you're still homeless. Probably. Unless the game comes up with some convoluted way. To not have you be homeless anymore. Yeah, that's her. Concussions and skull fractures. She's been in a coma for several months. Can we see Shit. her? Shit. No. Are you family? We're with the CIA. This girl is wanted for treason. Okay, game. I get that the you know that the government's after me now, but if I've been in a coma for several months, they should have already been here. So we have an arrest warrant if that's what you need. <clears throat> okay. I'll take you to her. I would have at least taken a look at that arrest warrant. Well, gotta escape out of the motherfucking window. I suppose there's about oh, to be no explanation as to how she survived That's that fall. Weird. This is a room. She should be here. Shit. She went out the window. Oh, that's impossible. We're on the fifth floor. She couldn't go out the window. Call it in. That girl cannot get away. And the game's not going to explain how she... Nope, it's not. Okay. <clears throat> or how she got new clothing matter either. Yep, the game started out as in, in, in medias res because that's the dude from the beginning. Is everything all right? Ma'am? Okay, so it's all coming. Okay, so when the game starts, that's the present. Got you. 
which really means that uh, almost was a long section. Fuck, but which really means that um, that regardless, I did not escape the building. Did not talk about Iden. Oh, most people did. Beat the thugs. Told the truth. Earn money honestly. Not enough money. Cold dinner. Oh, so it would have been a warm dinner. Did not help everyone after dinner. Did not run for the fire. Beat the thugs. Oh, you can learn the fate of the thugs. <laughs> did not escape the building. Well, if it wasn't for David Cage's weird-ass fucking QTEs, maybe I would've. <clears throat> First night. So now I'm going back in time. It won't be for long. Long enough for them to find out what's going on. Please don't leave me here. Ah, so this is when the parents Just drop a her off. Days. Couple yes. days, my ass. So as we need to go, there's no reason to drag this out. It was probably the dad's idea in the first to do it in the first place. Be brave, Donna. You're strong. I know you're strong. Here we have a better chance of understanding what's happening. We can find a way to protect you. Yeah, you're hearing it from the Green Goblin himself. Nobody can protect me. Not from him. Your belongings are in that bag over there. Cole and I are right next door. If you need anything or if anything's wrong, just call and we'll come right away. Okay. Although I'm going to assume that <clears throat> Good night, Jody. the parents must have told these guys about what happened beforehand. Which means that either she already produced proof of Aiden's existence to them, or else her parents are probably in some kind of psych ward maybe, who knows. Alright, find somewhere to change. Okay, uh... Well, she has her own apartment with... Nothing in it. Except for a computer. Well, that uh, that looks like a wardrobe to me, but I guess that's not where we're going, huh? Hope they haven't put cameras in here, too. <laughs> <laughs> you know, yeah, they might have, for all you know. Shit. You know what the, all these perverted old bastards do in their time? Even even she's like, yeah, there are cameras. Are there really ca Oh, yeah, there is, isn't there? Huh, there's a camera right there. Is there a camera in every corner of this whole damn... There is. Oh, my good. Oh, no, not that one. What about in here? Wow, there really is, yeah. No shit, huh? Hmm, interesting. Oh, that's the thing you Come were hugging earlier. Let's see where we're going to sleep tonight. <laughs> it's a bunny gruff. Well, there's a bed in the other room, so my guess would be that. Off to bed now, Jody. Well, I don't know. I'm in I'm in PJs. I have a bunny, and I'm in, I have a flashlight, and I'm heading to the bed. What the fuck do you think I'm doing? You don't need to tell me that. Unless, of course, this game isn't going to let me do it. Oh, I had to be on this side of the bed, right?
Mm. Did you ever turn off the lights? Oh. Good night, Jody. Wait. <laughs> Can you leave the light on in the hall? I, I don't like it when it's dark. Sure. How's that? Good. Good night. No, you could just night. give her a night light. Don't I used afraid. to have one of those damn things myself. Then I have a good night's sleep, and nothing is gonna happen. Something's gonna happen, all right? Your right side. <clears throat> is this game gonna make, gonna make a toss and turn again, really? David Cage, you have a weird obsession. I can't sleep, I didn't. Was doing think mundane I need a shit. Story. Go explore. Or not. So apparently, Aiden has his limits too. What the fuck? to hell for these things to come out, do you? Oh my god! So those things come after you on a regular basis? So apparently that portal to hell to the infra world, which I'm just going to call hell at this point, isn't needed for you to be attacked by those things. Woke up Cole, well yeah, didn't spy on Dawkins and parents, I didn't know you could, vanquished entities. Like other girls. I said no. End of story. Please, Nathan, just this once. All the other girls in my class are going, <laughs> and I won't be late. I promise, okay? You're wasting your breath, Jody. It's just not fair. How come everyone <laughs> can go and I can't? I do everything you ask of me all week, 
and I never get to have any fun. For the hundredth time, you're not like everyone else, and there are rules. Well, I didn't ask to be different. I just want to go out well, and you are. have friends and be like other girls my age. You'll never Too be like fucking them. fucking bad. You need to get used to that. <laughs> Although she's going through an emo phase, just like the rest of them. Good night. I'll be next door. Let me know if you need anything. <clears throat> In De Leody, does she still live in this one apartment, bro? It's redecorated now, but yep. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure she knew that when her parents said a couple days, she knew it was a load of shit. Oh god, no. <sighs> Fuck me. <laughs> I regret every minute of this now. And so does Cole. Come on, game. She's really into it. Oh my goodness. Tell you what, if I ever have a daughter, I really it's hope she doesn't night. go through an email. I'm locked up in here. Come on, I just want to go out and have some fun. I can't do it, babe. Rules are rules. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Come on, Cole. Please. Please let me out just this once. I would say fuck no. I'm sorry, princess. But I can't. It's not my call. <laughs> David Cage, I swear to fuck, dude, you do the weirdest shit with your games. Gotta admit though, it must be like hard on her psyche to be isolated like this. Let's see. I did Do my boy. For God's sake. Oh. We should have said so. This is not gonna do you any good. You're grounded. Period. Hey, Jody. You know better than to use Iden when you're angry. <laughs> Stop it, Iden. They don't give a shit if we break everything in this goddamn room. If that's not gonna work, we have to figure out what will. All right. I'm really sorry, Cole. <clears throat> I hate myself for doing this, but... You understand, right? I just... I need to go out tonight. Huh. Yeah, I know. 
It's too late to turn back now. All right, so he's gonna follow me everywhere I go. Locked. Of course it is. My main man. I'm getting the feeling this mission's gonna be a pain in the ass. <clears throat> well, hello, Cole, Jody. Little late for a day trip, isn't it? Yeah, I just, I'm feeling, um, I'm not, I'm feeling sick. I'm feeling sick, so we were just gonna go. Um, and get some fresh air. Okay, uh, you, want, you want I should call the infirmary? No, 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 there's, there's, there's no need. I'm, um, <laughs> you know, C Cole's looking after me, so. Right, Cole? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Cole? Okay, got your tongue? Hmm? <clears throat> lost his voice. I think it's like a, a virus or something. <laughs> I, that's more than, that's more than I've gotten out of him all, all day long. So. <laughs> you know, when it said speak, I thought it meant like I didn't was going to speak for him. Well, he's not contagious, buddy. You should be home in bed if you ask me. That's safer for all of us. <laughs> all right, well. See ya. Well, Go on now. you're convinced of that incredibly easily. <clears throat> well, at least we don't have to look for Cole's car. Because he's the only one here. <laughs> There's cameras everywhere. Better not hang around here too long. That's the idea. Get in the car and start it up. Yeah, passenger side. Trunk? Passenger should do. really out of sight. All right. Trunk it is. That's not the most glamorous <laughs> escape, but, but it'll do. Let's go, Aiden. I'll try not to attract <laughs> attention, okay? So apparently Aiden can drive a car and follow traffic laws.
You'll forgive me, right? I'll be back soon. And don't worry, I'll be fine. Are you just gonna leave him in the middle of the road? Okay, Aiden. Take him into the forest. Make sure he's safe. Oh my god. I didn't still, he's still tethered to me though, right? Well, this is the place. The girls must be inside already. I can only see bad things happening from this. What's some little emo bitch like her doing? Uh, like this? Has she? No, she hasn't. They're she not hasn't here yet. She hasn't done the CIA shit we'll wait, yet. Wait. So you do still have Aiden with you? Actually, How old are you? I should have probably chosen the booth. I just want to eliminate. You know, saying I'm 21 and then saying I just want a lemonade kind of defeats the whole purpose of you saying you're 21. But I suppose as long as you don't live where I live, you can be in a bar as long as you're not drinking alcohol. trying to figure out what to do here. Cool. By yourself? Root Eves. Hmm. Nah. I'd actually rather just play on my own. That's, that's okay. Shooting pool on your own. Takes two to play that game. I'd beg to differ. <clears throat> oh, and by the way, like I like what I said about earlier about you know like like when you have a choice of dialogue, but like the game will make it happen either way. I don't mind that in this situation because you know just because you say no, I don't want to play pool with you, you know. These guys can obviously sit there and say, yeah, well, we're going to play with pool with you anyway. I'm fine with that. Ladies first. Correct me if I'm wrong, but doesn't that guy with the longer hair look like a... Kara's first caretaker on uh, Detroit? And she's like the Kara archetype, actually. I swear to fuck, these QTEs. I'm just out to meet some friends. They'll, they'll be here any minute. <clears throat> I didn't see any reason to lie. Alright, 
so we gotta get ready for that QTE. Truth be told, you look kinda young to be in here. This is exactly why I said no initially. How old are you? Um, I'm 21. Now that I think about it, that was probably a really bad idea. Shit, because they might have been afraid of the statutory rape. God damn it. Go in, damn it. It just ain't your lucky night. Excuse me. Yeah, well, I haven't seen you get anything in either. Then again, the camera angle kind of hides it. All right, let's see if I can do it your this time. Your parents know you're in here? Yeah. Sure, they, they dropped me off. They'll be back. I'm, I'm sure they'll be back soon enough, too. <laughs> he knows you're full of shit. <laughs> All right, come on. Let's see if I can get the QTE this time. Hey, back off. Go on, baby. You know you want to. Oh, come on. Wait, is everybody just a rapist? Who's there? Is this bar just full of rapists, I guess? Where are you, creep? Show yourself! Creep. I think you're the creep. Come out, you fucking coward! Considering the fact that you can't see. Oh, that hurt like a bitch. Chicken out if I were you. <laughs> okay, this guy should be like dying by now. He's been hitting the face of the flying table. <laughs> How many times? It's like some fucking spirit come to punish us for our sins. <laughs> you sure? Girl, I don't want to die. Nobody's dying. We're getting the fuck out of here. Jesus. Jesus! What the fuck are you doing, Sam? Open the goddamn door. Ken! It's stuck. Get oh. out of the way. I'll break you down. They tried to rape her. What I want to know though is, did she even really have it's any okay. friends there or was that just some bullshit excuse okay. to get her to go to this bar for the attempted rape? <laughs> I gotta say David Cage, you have some sick fucking fantasies because this kind of shit is a recurring theme in your games. This is about to be it for number six. 
past the entrance guard, indeed. Yeah, okay. <laughs> didn't hear the customers. I don't, uh, I didn't hear, what? I didn't know you could. Snuck or pushed, rushed out the DPA. Stayed in the bar. I didn't know you could leave the bar. Killed at least one attacker. Yeah, beat the attackers. I didn't know you could leave the bar. Alone. Which means that this is going back to the beginning, more so. But regardless, this is number six.